private companies in um, national security. Yeah. I'd like to direct you to the case of South Africa, where the um, government has actually used private companies uh, police. And the result has been actually what you talked about at the beginning. The, um, the police was actually lobbying federal police to police them, and it's resulted in you know, corruption, uh, then beating up certain crime laws, leaving those alone. We should not see this as a possible problem. Oh yes, I don't believe in private police forces. I'm not an anarchist, I don't believe in private police forces. The state should control the police forces, control the military. I don't believe in private contractors for, for doing police work and for doing military work. You know, that's the job of the state. It's the only job of the state. They have only one job, they run a police force right, they run a military right, and they should do it. And South Africa, you know, those kind of examples are great examples of the fact that private police forces don't work. They corrupt, they're, they're corrupting, and they ultimately result in uh, gang warfare. My gang versus your gang. My police force versus your